The Leash, or Leg Rope as it's also known, is a truly great innovation that keeps you connected to your board and saves you swimming to shore every time you wipe out. The Leash consists of the cuff and horn which attaches to your ankle, the cord which comes in different lengths and thicknesses, and the rail saver which is designed to protect the tail of your board. When choosing a leash, as a general rule for average size waves, the leash should be roughly the same length as your board. For example, use a six foot leash for boards around 6.0 to 6.6 in length, or a nine foot leash for long boards around nine feet in length. For bigger waves and heavier, longer boards, it's always better to opt for a thicker cord. They typically come in three thicknesses, competition, regular, and big wave. But for the most part, a regular leash will suit most surfers. To attach the leash, you first need to attach the string to the leash plug. I like to tie the two ends of the string together, then loop one end through the plug and double it over. Next, attach the rail saver and secure using the Velcro straps. The string must be short enough so that the rail saver wraps around the rails in a range of different positions. If the string wraps around the rails, it will cut through the fiberglass. If you're a regular footer, you're going to attach the cuff to your right ankle. For goofy footers, your left ankle. Undo the Velcro strap and then attach it to your ankle. It needs to be firm, but not too tight. Be sure to position the horn so that it's directed towards the tail of your board when in a standing position. So that's it, you're ready to hit the water. But just remember, it's always a good idea to cover your face and head when you come up from a wipeout because your board can sometimes shoot back in your direction.